Hi, I'm Jim Bob. We're back at our spawner where we're going to make ourselves an experienced spawner thingy. Whatever. It's going to involve water and pushing zombies around and killing them. So, let's get started with this. First thing I'm going to do is hollow this out. And I'll want four blocks on either side of the spawner, about three under it and two above. So I'm going to start hollowing this out. And then I may cut away and come back when I've done a lot of the work. It'll depend how things are going. Because there's going to be a lot of digging. A lot, a lot of digging. And more digging, and more digging. So I'm going to be using a lava killing switch. Oh, button. I'll hit the button, the lava will kill the mobs. And, well, it won't kill them, it'll bring them down to one hit. Then I'll be able to punch them and get the experience, or throw a potion at them. And kill a whole bunch at once. But the main part of the killing will be done by lava. Likely. What I'm going to do is I'm going to attach this. Whoa, whoa, stop that. And attach this to my main base. And I'm thinking of challenging myself a bit here and building some sort of boat system. It's been a while since people have really done that. And I don't like all the noise that minecarts make. So I'm thinking I just might go for that. Because it should be interesting, and I want it to be all underground. Okay, so I got three. So I'm going to hollow this out to four on each side. I've also brought some glowstone blocks. So that I can make myself a switch. Okay, that already is four. Why am I hollowing that out even more? Let's see, that one's three. So I definitely gotta hollow this out. I'm gonna try and make this look half decent as well. I've got some more stone cooking at home. What am I for? I'm just gonna hollow this right out. Whoa! Just about killed myself. What am I doing? Oh, -ho. okay. How many more of those is there? Just one. Oops, that was supposed to be a torch, but I don't have any right now. I want the ceiling to be about too high, so we're doing good so far. Hopefully three stacks of smooth stone cooking at home will be enough for what I have planned. Okay, so that's hollowed out to five. That's hollowed out to four. And I'll have to make a little way around. So I'll have somewhere to put the redstone. One of these sides will have to be just a little bit longer than the others. Enough so that the mobs will be able to drop down into it. Or maybe not. Yeah, that should be alright. So let's see. I'm going to want two blocks on top of this anyways. I might as well get a feel for this. That's how high the ceiling is going to be. Right here will be a wall. So I gotta hollow this out. Then I'll place a wall around it. Because this will be the little area where all the wiring is gonna go for the lighting. You actually only need four torches or four glowstone in the area in order to illuminate the whole thing.
I do want to see if I make this look half decent. But I don't know. I'm not so good at that kind of thing. We'll see where we wind up with. Okay, you spawned in a dark corner, you little bugger. Okay, this could take a while. <laughs> And I'm probably going to want to fill this all in. Okay, get rid of that. I want to fill in all the spaces so we don't wind up with voids. Where things can spawn. Oh, one too many. Okay. Now, not exactly my favorite building material, this cobblestone. I'm doing it for yep, so. I'll lay down my glowstone first. That's right. I gotta hollow this out another space. Stay up at me. So oh, that could be there because it'll be even with the ceiling. That's one, three, four. Yeah. I think we're getting somewhere now. Least favorite substance is gravel. And one, two, three, four, five. Okay, we should get rid of this chest. Now, for the slightly more difficult part, putting the redstone down. I don't know why I'm doing this. I'm being a little too fussy, I think. I think I want to have a floor that's all the same. Even if it's just cobblestone, I want it all to be the same. So let's see what we wind up with. Okay. Lots of cobblestone, so we'll use some of that. And it's too bad I didn't have more than a green, a mossy stone. Okay, now we'll put some redstone down. Actually, before we do that, we should put some blocks down. Put a block behind each one of these. Because we'll need something for the redstone to travel through. Okay. And we'll put a repeater after each one of these. Come on, go down. There we go. Oh, come on. There we go. Oh, got that one for a shot. What do you know? Miracles do happen. I really don't need one after that one, I think. So then we'll take our redstone. Hopefully I brought enough. Might as well 
put a switch down. This is just a temporary switch. Put this in a much better spot later. There we go. I don't need this many repeaters, but it's going to sort of go around in a circle when it turns on and off. Okay, so there's the beginnings. Now we'll close some of these walls in. I have a lot of hollowing out to do on the floor. Okay, so there's the basics. You know what? I am going to hollow this out so I can get around inside here a little bit better. Which means I have to put up with a little bit more gravel, I think. that. Ah! Okay, well I don't need all these anymore. So let's grab a few of these torches. Oh, I can't put those there. Oh well. Oh yeah, that's right. Okay, I like that. Dropping it on redstone. Does the same thing as dropping it on a torch. Now. being so fussy. Just thinking I might put some other sort of block in the middle. I'm not too sure. Okay, what's not right here? That's only three wide. Stupid Jim Bob. Oh, 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 Bob, wait, wait. Turn to ambush me. Okay. I was so stupid. I miscounted. Okay, go down one more to put my fancy floor. Okay, Bob, you're getting annoying. I gotta put one there. I should eat something. I'm liable to kill myself. Okay, we'll try this again. I'm so glad these things don't break permanently when you hit them with a pickaxe. Now what I should have been doing before, instead of jumping up and down like a maniac trying to put these down, What did I just do? I'm getting so stupid. I guess I do have to jump up and down like a maniac. 
Come on. There we go. Okay, we're back here again. This time everything's right. Wonder why my ceiling wasn't quite turning out the way I expected. Okay, I've done a little bit of work here. Take on a tour of my new zombie killing machine. Hollowed it all out. These two blocks keep them from spawning on top. Drop in the water, they go down there. Now, once they get there, they're going to wind up going all the way up to the top. And I'll take a trip, but before I do that, just so that I don't wind up dying. And put some water at the bottom here. So they come along here, they go all the way along here. They're pushed into here, and they jump when they're in water, so they go up, 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 up. All the way up. Takes a little bit of time, because this all does drop damage. They come up here, have a nice little view, and then they drop to their death. Well, mostly to their death. Because once here, I just sit here and punch them. We'll turn this on, just so we can see. There's three, four of them right there. Going right in. And I think I've got this still. Yeah. <clears throat> we'll take a little look at them as they're going up the ladder. This is where they go up. Oh, you see Bob going up there. Oh, I lost my way. There we are. In a little while, they're all going to start dropping down here. There we go. There's our first one. And they take most of the damage. I have to refine this a bit, because I don't have them down to one hit kills yet. They're between two and three. But that's alright, because I plan to kill them with splash potions. Or I'll just whack them with a splash potion and kill like a whole lot of them. Like 80 of them at a time. But that's the basic idea of this. It's mostly done. All you need is four lamps for this entire room. So we have ourselves an experienced machine. Now I've just got to finish my enchantment room so that I can actually get something from all this. Because right now my enchantment room is kind of empty. It's missing a few books. I have a heck of a time remembering how to get out of here. Please don't be night. Okay, we're not night. I'll see this from the outside. You can see right here. I'll just patch up a few areas. But you can see them as they go along here. I might make this out of glass, but it actually doesn't look too bad the way it is. Now we'll come here and we'll follow our torches home. Because luckily I left lots of torches. And here we go. Let's run. I was going to make a complex system to kill them out of lava. But I ultimately decided it really wasn't worth the trouble. I'd rather kill like about 80 of them with a splash potion than to sit there and kill 80 of them one punch at a time. Just doesn't seem to make much sense. Used a lot of hunger and a lot of food. Okay, where am I? Am I lost? I could have sworn my home was around here somewhere. Oh, there it is. I'm very tempted to put a mini-map on here. But I don't want to cheat. And I'm going to take that sign down. 
that time. That's kind of ridiculous, actually. I'm almost out of food. I do something about these vines. I was only meant to grow a few. I hear zombies here. Are they going to come up and attack me? Do I got another spawner around here? If I have one really close to my house, I'll be kind of annoyed. Although I could use some stuff like saddles, so I guess it wouldn't be that bad. I think I've got to make a cow farm. That should be one of my next projects. And let's see. Let's enchant my already mostly used pickaxe with as good as we can get. Which isn't that good. It's only about like 14 levels. Yeah, I think that's about as good as we're going to get. Let's see what we get. Efficiency 2. Okay, so we'll just go a little quicker. And I don't want to enchant anything else. I was hoping to get unbreaking so it would last a little bit longer. But hey, you get what you can get. I gotta finish this book myself off. Get it all done. So I can do something half decent. So I gotta put all this stuff away off camera. Because I got too much junk. But I shall see you guys next time. See you later.